Hi, this is John from Sales Pop, and in the first quarter of 2023, we've been focusing on mental health in the workplace. We've interviewed a, a lot of great experts with some phenomenal insights, and this is the year to finally break the stigma. So check it out. We're damaging our thoughts by allowing certain certain ideas or certain narratives to take control of our thoughts. You're never gonna amount to anything, Paul. Nothing's ever gonna happen. This year's gonna suck. Failed one, one more time in my life? Well, I guess I'm a failure because I, I just keep failing. Other people, that's okay if they need help, but I felt somehow weak because um, because I needed it. Stigma around if you display mental health struggles, that you may not be emotionally strong. What prevents people to seeking help? We shame people with mental illnesses. If someone, you know, hits their head, we wouldn't, mm. you know, put them down if they had a headache and go, well, that's a weakness in your head. You just, you mm. need a thicker skull. With burnout, it's very specific related to your career. Stress is a gateway to other things. Not taking action to reduce your anxiety and stress is harmful. And let's face it, we, we celebrate stress and anxiety. And that's the danger. Take that first step. If you're struggling, right, like it's okay to let people know. You know, take moments for yourself during the day. When my little voice comes in, I, I just take a moment and I take a deep breath and I say, you're not welcome in my thoughts. Get the heck out. I think it's all about leading from the front. You mm -hmm. can build that community and you start with trust. Uh, so many of the things that we experience as stress are preventable. Um, we're not going to treat mental illness any different than we're, than we're going to treat physical illness. If you're seen, heard, and understood, every moment in the workplace, I mean, it's incredibly free.